Hey guys, it's still busy plastering on the outside of it. Uh, wait for the cement to get a bit harder before we can float it. Uh, doing a very nice job. And please with it. Still need to float it up there. Can't see really, but it looks nice. And then we put on this here for the rain all along and for the sun to not affect the cement. Otherwise, if it dries too quickly, this happens, but it's not a major thing at all. It's easy to sort this out. This also remember behind this is a whole piece of concrete, but because there's also a concrete piece behind it and it's not totally blocked, you do often find this happen as well. Um, yeah, otherwise, won't complain. And then tomorrow you can continue finishing this little piece underneath here. And we will be starting the side of the wall of the house. Hi guys, I'm busy making the brackets um, for the roof over here. Let me show you guys. To support this beam. The bracket I'm cutting now will sit here. We weld it on here to keep this beam on top of this here. So it will be sitting there across here. So as I've been cutting it, I must do it on both sides, front and back. I have to make all together, cut 16 of them and then I'm going to take triangles. I'm made out of the same metal, 5mm thick. Like you guys can see here, uh, I really can see how thick it is. As I make it 5cm by 10cm, it can be 5 by 5 but I'm making it a little bit longer. And then I'll cut it, the other one's in half, and I'll cut it from there across to the side, like a little triangle. So when this will sit up on the other metal plate, it's being welded on, like that, it'll have to support from here to there. And that, so that'll help it to keep it nice and steady, not just welded like that. I only require it to be welded like that. But I don't want it, I want a bit of support in there that that thing can be supported and it will be much stronger embracing from here to there. I'll show you guys a bit later what I meant. But for now, okay, guys, I'm gonna show you. I've cut all my pieces finished, like you can see over there. You take this magnet to make sure it's 90. Place it over there and take a little triangle and put it like that in your other place in the bottom. We will cap and we will wall it later. So guys, what we're going to do is, we already welded this one in Indriku, and then we got that done, just painting the back, and then we're going to place it on here, over there, 
I'm just going to make sure this is square, it's not square yet, to bring it back. Wall that in the middle of it. And then pull this totally back to come flash over here so it's straight and level up. That's what we'll do. This is Yanni, my painter. He's busy building a house for his wife uh, Lisa. How's it, Melanie? Yeah, he's working very hard. So, so when uh, goes some couples and moves the road. It's Friday today and it's hot. We drink all the water and uh, we're gonna chill on here. We are we are boiling like uh, like uh, like the frog in the in the pot, you know. Okay guys, today Enrico is walling there and continue cleaning the, um, the pole, sanding it down, make it look like even over there, try my best over there and then we'll paint it all and do all the little tippies on there we walled before or paint them so they don't get rusted. We'll continue this side, do the last two over there, we've only got three poles left to do and then we'll start the other side of the first row after. So yes, let's get started. is 15 degrees okay so we the, the metal part of it is 90 so you take uh, 15 degrees minus uh, 90 degrees give you 75 okay you set the degrees on 75 and that gives you your angle you need to cut the metal this piece here to come out and then what we did is we took two flat bars and we really worked the angle out the really on the 75 I'll show you guys the 75 to 15 degrees and that's it there so that's the angle of your pitch of your roof so guys that's your piece I cut off We've done the other side already and it's done. Now we'll just take these two pieces and we'll put it together on top of the roof and the pitch will come out like this. It's 15 degrees, 15 degrees. So that's how your, your roof will sit. 